Shock poll, the latest Roy Moore numbers are in. The floor just dropped out on. The race for an Alabama Senate seat has captured the national stage. That was due, at first, to the strong support conservative Judge Roy Moore enjoyed among voters and President Donald Trump. But when word broke that Moore was being accused of sexual misconduct towards minors, things got dicey. Accusers claimed that the judge behaved inappropriately toward them years ago, when they were teens. It was a clear attack by the left to destroy the judge's chances. But it looks like the case against him is falling apart and Moore is back on top. From the Gateway Pundit Judge Roy Moore is once again leading ultra-liberal Democrat Doug Jones in the predicted market. Before the Washington Post story broke last week, Roy Moore was almost a lock to win at 89 percent in predicted Alabama Senate race prediction market. After the allegations surfaced, Moore's odds dropped to 59 percent that day. He remained a slight favorite over Doug Jones, who also saw a significant bump on the news, until Monday when a fifth woman came forward with allegations against Moore. As of Monday afternoon, for the first time in the race, predicted traders had Doug Jones in the lead at 47 percent to Moore's 38 percent. Moore has since regained some ground though he still trails in the prediction market. But as of Saturday afternoon conservative Republican Roy Moore is back up on top of Doug Jones in the Alabama race. Moore now leads in the predicted market 52 to 49. It didn't help Owens when the main accuser's story fell apart and her attorney refuses to turn over a forged yearbook to neutral authorities for analysis. There were red flags coming from these allegations from the start. The fact they came out just a month before the election made many believe they were politically motivated. Moore enjoyed a massive lead over his uber-liberal rival. The left had to pull out all the stops, even blatantly lie, to get a slight edge. But it seems like the case against him has enough hold to warrant skepticism. Add to that the long reputation he's had in Alabama as a strong, uncompromising leader. The people of Alabama trust him, despite the allegations. And now he just saw a massive 14 point swing. It's probably only the beginning as the allegations crumble and Democrat, media scandals such as Al Franken and Charlie Rose take center stage. Then there's the fact that his rival, Doug Jones, is a super-liberal Democrat who supports full-term abortions. That's not something conservative Americans in the South can stomach. It remains to be seen, though, what will happen. The election is still weeks away. We will continue to watch it, to watch it.